I like to think of us as a healthy congregation. We're the body of Christ, and it's important that we be a healthy body so that we can faithfully represent Christ in this world. A church that really seeks to touch the community, all the community, not just the upscale individuals but the least of us. My church is awesome, and I think that my church uh, has a blessing that are willing to go outside of their walls and really be outside what Jesus Christ is calling us. We are praising God in different ways, and all of that is crazy, but we are doing that because it's a step of faith of this church. To lovingly go outside the walls of our church and be open to receive people where they are. Um, through uh, the ministry center, um, our youth groups, our adult groups, just everything. Um, it, we really, I believe, are focusing on the right things, which is helping others be, um, become part of the kingdom. We have a lot of talented people. And by that, I mean, uh, they're talents that you, you know are God-given. still seeking, regardless of age, we're, we're seeking to have a deeper relationship with Jesus. Um, we just pray every morning that God will be here with us and guide us through our day. Um, I just again hope that these children leave here with knowing that God is in their heart. That they remember that this was a place where um, they not only learn about Jesus, but where they are loved. There are other people that do individual small things uh, that some people don't know anything about, but it's because their heart has been so affected. Mm -hmm. And it's not just a, a social doing, it's genuine from the heart. I mean, people walk in the door and they're welcomed. Uh, if they don't come, they're missed. Being in Sunday school in the mornings and seeing all the older kids come in and help and, and volunteer and um, really be a part of the church, seeing my older sisters go through youth group um, and watching them become young adults and, and be engaged and involved with, with the youth group at, at Northern Hills down on Higgins Road. Uh, I had one young lady that would come and stand beside me and she knew the Lord's Prayer. She couldn't speak the words, pronounce the words, but she knew them and she knew what they were and she would elbow me in the side, he'll cut it off, Phil, it's time for the Lord's Prayer. There's a lot of freedom to try different things to really, even if it hasn't been done that way before, you'll find a lot of support of, hey, let's try it. Let's really try to do some new things for God's kingdom. not a specific service I have friends all over the church that I'll just run into and bring a smile to my face and it's it's not just with the youth it's not with the young adults it's with all generations it's it's a wonderful season and we look forward to more reaching teaching and loving the world that Jesus died to save. In